Aloha beautiful souls and welcome back to the channel. My name is Marissa Indigo. I am the founding director and head mystic at Divine DNA Blueprint Mystery School. And today we're going to talk about expanding your energy, really starting to build more of a relationship with yourself as an energetic being and starting to really be able to sensitize yourself to feeling your energy fields and starting to perceive and feel the difference between whether you're kind of contracted and whether you're expanded and very easy ways to expand yourself. So some of these practices that I'm going to show you are so simple and basic. You're going to be amazed at how easy it is to just consciously open your energy fields back up again. This can be something you even do at a red light in your car or in the morning before work. One of the most wonderful ways to work with this is to stand out in the sun and get your face in that sunlight and proceed. So the first one is tapping the palm chakras in the center of your hands. So you could do three, you could do seven, you could do a hundred, whatever taps that you like to do. But this is a very powerful way to immediately feel a difference in the energetic fields around your palms, around your hands. You think about how important our hands are, how we touch everything with our hands, right? In our day-to-day -day lives. So opening your energy fields through the chakras, you actually have beautiful eyes and whole vortex chakras in the center of your palms here. So just standing out in the sun, bringing your hands together at your heart and just taking a moment to just breathe and be and welcome yourself into the world. This is a great thing to do in the morning. And then just tap, 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 and just feel what you feel right now. And just feel what you feel. Can you feel a little bit of a percolation, perhaps a very gentle vortex sensation at your palms? Any of you, if you have ever done acupuncture, you may be super sensitive to the energetic vortexes, which are actually a part of our entire body meridian system. And depending on the energetic system that you're studying in Ayurveda or the Vedic wisdom of the Far East, they're called the Marma points, which you can access through massage or acupuncture. And then in the traditional Chinese medicine, right, they are their acupressure points. So we actually have a whole map all over our body of these different points. And then these energy centers are concentrated. We also in the yogic system refer to these as the nadis, right? So we have like 72,000 nadis all over our body, our energy body. So you can start to see just how powerful it is to activate them. So one of my favorites that we showed you is in the palms. Another one that's super powerful, super supportive is just tap, tap, tap on your sternum and your heart center, and then your higher heart at your thymus, uh, and you can tone it a little bit, but just tap, 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 and you can, you start to feel your heart chakra, bam, just opening up. Another one, if you're working on releasing your truth, expressing, connecting to your own wisdom, and wanting to really work on speech, right, and conscious, compassionate communication, tap your throat. Another powerful way is tapping your face. And this feels so good in the morning or at night also to assist you to relax. But all of a sudden, you know, you tap around the orbitals here of the eyes, you tap the third eye, you actually have like seven plus eyeballs here going all the way up the front of your forehead. So you can really start to tap all of those, tap the sides of the head here, the temples, and then you can go all the way around and tap, tap, especially at the fontanelle at the top of the head. And it feels so amazing. It, to me, it feels like a massive pressure release valve when I start to tap all over my body. And using the fontanelle here, that's the crown chakra. And when we come into this world, that's where we are, the plates have to still completely seal, right? To seal us into this physical experience and the physical incarnation. So tapping the fontanelle can be very powerful to connect and open up your crown, right? Connect with your higher wisdom faculties of God consciousness in this beautiful new era in which we find ourselves. Lastly, one of my all time favorites, to open up my energy and to assist myself also in just a cellular release, right? Releasing all of the tension is a good head massage. So just really get your fingers in there. Oh my goodness. And go all the way, just digging in, dig into your skull. Make sure to get that back, that release, the eject button there. Uh, also called the mouth of God chakra, right where the cervical spine connects in to your skull. So just press in there. 
breathe. Ah, and it's like a pop and unlock, like so much energy that was maybe held back there at that. It's a massive plug where if we're not paying attention all of a sudden, we're like, oh, somehow I accidentally just kind of slipped back there into the old paradigm and got myself a little bit plugged into some of the old shenanigans. No worries. Just pull out the plug. <laughs> so you want to massage, massage, massage your head, your skull, all of it. So amazing. So supportive. Amazing that these tiny little micro practices like this done consistently, all of a sudden you can feel your field radiating out. You can feel more movement. You have moved energy. All of these are fantastic when you are going through any of the clearing, the deep work that we do almost on a daily basis with this ascension process, right? So anytime you feel yourself start to shut down or you feel something that's uncomfortable or tight within yourself, or you're going through some processes, maybe you're even having the physical ascension experience and sensations right now that so many of us are really concentrated in the head. So if you're having the headaches and any of the sinus discomfort, tapping, tapping, tapping around the bones here of the face, and pressing in gently, pressing at the temples, really massaging, and the tapping around the crown can really support you as well. So thank you so much for tuning in. This is just a fun little download for you all of the mystery or mastery school technology for us to support us thriving in this new era in our Ascension journey. Thank you so much for joining me, sending you so much love and aloha, and I'll see you soon. Namaste.